Hey everybody, Dan here. Today we're going to take off the front wheels and replace them with brand new ones. And this is why. When you're mowing along and you have this much slop, it's kind of hard to do without being on the ground, but when you have this much slop in your wheel, this way, look at this, this way, and obviously up and down, you're causing your mower deck to be uneven and chop the yard. And if you're a homeowner, you might be okay with that, uh, just doing your own property. But if you're doing this for a living, your customers are not going to be okay with that. They want their yard to look nice, whether you do stripes or you just carpet mow, whatever you're gonna do, they want it to look good. So when you start seeing this slop, it's time to replace your wheels. So how do you do that? Man, it's real simple. Let's put this up. Now, most of these little mowers are gonna be the same. You need a 14 millimeter on a socket and you just go ahead and break torque on these bolts. Sometimes you gotta pop them. You gotta pop them with a, you know, with your hand or with a hammer to break torque on them. But really, that's it. It's a threaded axle. And then, there you go. Now inside this wheel is a bushing. And what happens is, on these lower end models, like a Troy built, MTD, um, you're just gonna have a little steel bushing in there. Well, that steel bushing is going to wear out on this steel axle. And that's how you end up with all this slop. So take this off. The bushing comes out with it. Here's your axle right here. Here's your new one. And it's got the brand new bushing already pressed in. You don't do anything. Take off the old, put on the new. And then you got really no slop whatsoever. Now you tighten it down. Nice and tight. And you got very little slop compared to the other side or to the other wheel that you had on there. So uh, just make sure that you put it on the right way so you can put your hubcap back on if you're running hubcaps. I don't run the hubcaps, I just play frisbee with them. Now, should you grease these before you put them on? I say no, because the only thing the grease is going to do is attract dirt. The only thing dirt's going to do is be sandpaper, and the only thing sandpaper is going to do is wear out your bushing even faster. Just let it ride. It's going to last, I don't know, I mean I got about 400 yards out of this mower, so I don't know what you expect, you know, for these, these cheaper mowers. Uh, but like I said, I got about 400 yards out of this motor or this mower uh, before I started having to do this um, replacing the wheels. So um, if you're a homeowner, that's probably about eight years of life out of a wheel. So uh, just something to think about. All right, let's go ahead and uh, do the next the next one real quick. You don't have to um, have the mower sitting up on its side. I just did that for video purpose. But all you got to do have it like this. Pop it. And there you go. Take off the old bushings inside. Pretty yuck. Put on the new. That's it guys. Front end's like new now. Alright? So that's that. Just quick little replacement of the front wheels. Next video we're gonna do is we're gonna replace the front end. That is gonna be a challenge. That is gonna be a heck of a video.